Hey guys, Austin here. Today, yes, today, we are back with a brand new video. As you can tell, we are playing with Wigan Athletic. I'm very excited to get into it because, as you can see, we're currently top of the table. Although we're actually drawn on points with Sheffield United. We're going to jump in. We're going to see if we can get another win for the season. And as you can see, we've got a pretty good standing right now. We've won eight games and we've only drawn one. And we haven't lost any. So hopefully I want to keep that up as much as possible. I'm going to jump in. We're going to see what we can do. Obviously, we want to win. As does any manager. Yeah, we're going to get into it. We're going to see what we can do. Hello, I'm excited. Here, just to the fun. I don't know what's good. I can't believe Elton John Watson, actually supports. And I believe this is Stan named after him. Unless I'm totally wrong in that factor, but I believe that's true. I can't remember. Yeah. If anyone that knows me knows that I support Man United and I literally watched my team get absolutely slaughtered by Liverpool. It was, to say the least, the worst game we've played this whole season. And a scoring update for you from the I, I game. don't know that what we went wrong, Scott. but hopefully we can somehow bring it back on Thursday when we're playing against back. real Betty. Hopefully we can manage to win it. I, I well, no don't want to just lose that momentum that we've gained. I feel like well, what a start to Ten Hag is kind of like to watch. Been brutal to win. They deserve to be top of the tree. I like it. And I saw Chelsea well, to win today own. against Borussia Dortmund, which was well, crazy. <laughs> and then Benfica obviously won, which is well, crazy because they played amazing. And the problem not completely like, solved. no doubt about it. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. We're still looking for our first goal. They were only 20 minutes in. Moving forward effectively. And I feel like watching the United game, it, it was terrible. There's our first goal. Hopefully we can keep it up. Obviously we want to keep it up as much as possible. It's a thing that we want to be doing. I, we want to be pushing out wins. I obviously you do it for the well, fans. The I, for me, managing the team. I, I remember when we were it's in the really Premier League. Finish, which gives the keeper no and goal. now, I believe just sitting like bottom of the table, which is not good for them at all. But yeah, scored Chris Sal. No idea how you pronounce that, well, but then. yeah. Giving the ball to the opposition that time. No. Well, I'm hearing changing circumstances in the Swansea game. Alex Scott. It's a goal for Swansea City. It was... Must be. Let's go. Legend. Well, can they draw level here? The crowd certainly think so. I feel like he's a youth player. So the corner played Although, into the box. I can we never remember. I, I have that many series going on for like FIFA it's box. hard to keep track unfortunately again. they brought it back when I need to off well, our game like 100% and, and we don't want to be losing against Watford although we're going to probably lost against Watford this season again here on the back of that like 100% I know they're playing pretty decent Pedro 
Let's go. Matter of fact, they're not a bad team neither. But I know I have a feeling Burnley are going to be promoted to the Premier League. Which fully deserved, to be honest, because they're playing amazing. And I'm excited to see what they can actually do in the Premier League. It's a short one. Play towards the back post. I feel and like with Vincent Company being the, the manager, it's just brought out played. a whole different meaning for them. Anthony Scully. And the way he can we'll navigate that team minutes. is can they forge ahead? beyond amazing. Well, they would have done had it not been the corner. Well, they should be ahead there. Close to the he half time. Good save, and he's fired over the corner. Oh, that's top notch goalkeeping, you've got to say. Damn. And no more time left. That concludes the first half the here at Bullet of the save. Like, bro. You straight up, like, denied us. <laughs> well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see I how the second see half we can roll back to the former glory. I don't know if Colo Torre is still the manager. I'm actually not playing good at all. <laughs> Interception to snuff out the danger. But I have no idea. I don't really. The, the only team I really keep up with in that league action. is uh, Burnley. Because TV. that's it's where I'm from, so. Great it makes to make sense. <laughs> Fletcher. Now, he is one of my favourite players for what? For what? Food? For Wigan. And I just saw Tom Cleverley coming off. Which I actually like him. I believe he played for Man United. He sounds familiar. Well, opting for the short corner. And players waiting at the far post. Thumps clear. No. <laughs> and he's lost custody of the ball here. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. <laughs> His keeper is literally saving so our rear end. Well, this is a big moment, and don't these fans know it. They're going for the short one. And the cross into the middle. Dude. And with the goalkeeper. But I believe changing circumstances in the Burnley game. Let's see all about it from Alex. God's name was yeah, that. Absolutely atrocious, mate. Thanks for the update, Alex. Well, this is the home of live football and more live action from the championship coming your way on EA TV. Oh, can he score here, Derek? And it's in! <laughs> no way. Yo, big up to Fletcher, man. He's just phenomenal for us. I he just comes on the pitch like. Well, here Bro. it is again. It was a good finish. The keeper has amazing. to do better at his near post. He was beaten far too easily on that occasion. Whew. Come on. We can do it. But I still want Sheffield United to lose. Like, very much. <laughs> They're currently tied with us on points. Can they create something from here? Well, the attack showed promise, but easy work I would, the would the say end. if that went in, keeper. But what I are you doing? There's been a goal in the Swansea match. Alex Scott has all the details. Oh. A chopping challenge, and the referee has got to have a big think about it. I don't know. Well, the away side haven't lost the possession, as you can see, but that won't bother them because when they win it in deep areas, they've got full I mean, pace and with numbers. Tackle, it's been a bad tackle per se. Attacking display. It was just and the threat on the wrong time. Wrong time. Very real. Here they come again. 
nicely timed tackle. Ooh. He's got bowled well, like a deck chair, mate. For understandable reasons in Mappy. this case. To confirm, Millwall did score in that match. And that game is on a knife edge now. Oh, well. Level at 2-2. Two -two. Well, the corner it is. Let's and they go. know they've got to be opportunistic at this stage of the game. Got that defending. Well, he's gone short with it. Targets available, cross comes in. Ah! And pushed onto the woodwork. Oh my days. Well that was the big hey. like that. The onus is on the to take action potentially. I don't even know what happened then. <laughs> and he does produce the yellow card. Even one of them certainly deserved the yellow. It's a poor challenge, you have to say. No one just knee a tackle and it's just like Cayenne. <laughs> just makes you question. The <laughs> crazy stuff. The Three minutes of stoppage time. Can Come they on. fashion something? They need a goal. Well, fling himself at it. I Go love this end. keeper. The oh, they keeper is up. Let's go. T1. That was stressful. Well, Derek, it was very I thought we managed to win that somehow. Oh, Watford definitely put us through our paces right now. Well, we're focusing on him for a reason. Ashley Fletcher came on, scored a goal yeah, to see really that win, to give them the lead. which we love to see. We want to see more of it, obviously. I'm excited to see what we can do. We're into the post match interview and see what the press is saying, obviously. Actually, we love the press. Totally. <laughs> Got time for a couple of questions? That's it. Thanks very much. <laughs> oh, we've got a chat. I oh, know. I'm remembering, but shit. Yeah. Loan to buy. Yeah, I don't want him to go out for loan to buy. I'm trying to negotiate it. Oh, is FIFA like broken or something? And what was that? <laughs> like, hello? <laughs> yeah. 
our second match. And they get the whole city. Interesting. Yeah, and Sheffield United still haven't... Still on the same amount of points as them. It's going to be interesting. Uh, let's change about the team a bit. Um, I'm gonna with that team. That'd be interesting, actually. And I'm like, I remember so many of these teams in the Premier League, and it's crazy to see where they've got. It's crazy to see that when I was like 10, they were like, Hull City, I, Wigan, Portsmouth were in the Premier League the then. Players, players that that missing, was so crazy. I remember to back then, I was collecting like match question. attacks for that kind of stuff. I feel like I still have my orange book. So for Wigan Athletic, it I, I would literally just go to the, the shop sometime and spend like two pounds on four packs really of them. Today, I feel like they were like, I feel like 50 p or something. They were like so cheap. Determined defending. Lang. Man, that brings back like so much memory. <laughs> I feel old even talking about match attacks. I, I don't defending. even know if they're still doing. Sayad Manish. And if they do, then oh, this is crazy. looking promising. Must be wasted chance. Easy for the goalkeeper. And a changing situation in the card of game. Alex, who has scored? You can't really tackle like oh. that and expect to get away with it. Booking it to come, <laughs> you would think. Wasn't even a bad well, foul. Like, and it's yellow. I'll be honest, it's like, me personally, I probably wouldn't have given him a yellow card. Well, to Alex, apologies I just for having feel like to interrupt it would... you just then. To clarify, Cardiff have found the net in that match, and their lead stands up. It seemed like a bad tackle. Should the free kick make sense? The rest. Eh. Randall Williams. Good tackle. Well, I feel like sometimes the referees Running nowadays the they just position. they do not Walking seem qualified to be referees, and it's blatantly obvious. Like some decisions that they turn a blind eye to, and it's just like why? Sayad Manish. And with that, the attack. I mean, VAR, it's not a bad see, thing, really the play, I feel like, I finally understand it, I, well, just lack of when I was young, it was not there. such thing as VAR, I, and Smith. It was just not a concept in Still like any turns, retrospect, and it's just, just funny to see and bring it in. Like years ago, that Sydney. wasn't even a thing. 
Alahyar Syed Manish. Come on. He's in with a chance. And what? so it is. The first half story Whoa. has been written. Ah. Oh. Still absolutely nothing. I wouldn't bring on Fletcher. Because I always know he's going to come out and literally get us a goal. <laughs> One of the many reasons I actually like Fletcher is he's always hungry for goals. And that is something you definitely need in a team. Bro, look at that. He comes on, he supplies us with a goal. Things we love to see. Well, here it is again. He goes past the marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really I won't lie. Hall of City and actually doing decent. Like, they're not doing a bad job. Yeah, I feel like they're a bit of a tough team to. Alexander Sirota. Possession one. Work with. Will it be? And they oh. can't add to their oh, advantage. No. <laughs> well, that would have put them oh, in no. control. He should have scored there. That was so unfortunate. <laughs> will occur now. Right, from what I'm hearing, something this has changed to keep in the Cardiff this game. Win. Let's get the information from Alex Scott. We don't want to give Sheffield one. Sheffield one, right? Yeah. Sheffield one, right? Sheffield United Scott. a reason to go Semi. to the top of the table. Real chance. Although, and a goalkeeper on top Ooh. of his game. Well, it's keeper saving us is. again. I feel like so our keepers are just made to do that at this point. Crazy. Keen to take it short here. Head over towards the back post. Let's go. But at one point on its flight, I wondered if the keeper would have difficulties, but no problems in the end. Just looking ahead to another game coming up for you. Oh, I'm running you up for donut. TV. It's Wigan Athletic facing Sheffield United. Well, Derek, I'm really looking forward to it. Always a great atmosphere in that stadium, and it should be an entertaining match. Ooh. Callum Elder. I just went, meow. Simmons. <laughs> he ran Come the on. situation defensively and did his job. Well, they might be onto something. Oh, oh my days. Who <laughs> would have thought you'd be sweaty in 2023? I do not miss the days of someone doing that in like in the 19th minute in like Ultimate Team. The pure heartbreak that you face with that is horrible. <laughs> That reminds me, I don't really play online Ultimate Team anymore. And it's one of them things I I, I don't really care for anymore. I, I do play Ultimate Team, but I play Swamp Battles. It's a complete objective. And I will admit, I do have a pretty decent team. We're going to corner. Let's see about the delivery. He can't get off. <laughs> Unfortunately, love it. Still winning. And news of a goal in the Bristol City game. Alex Scott. Yeah, it's a third goal for Sheffield United. The defender was caught in possession just before the goal. You won't want to be watching that back. They're ahead by three now with 79 minutes played. Unfortunately, not. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Poor pass under no real pressure. 
That could have gone terribly. Fletcher. He's got the right idea with that pass. Oh, it's almost did the trick for them. Great defending. <laughs> The referee's verdict is three Bro. additional minutes. This guy was having a great time. Ooh. There it is! As all the absolute scene of that. Three nil. Oh, Fletcher is literally a different breed. Like this guy. Well, here's the Bro. replay, and it all starts off with that cross into the box, just begging for a teammate to get on the end of it. But the finish is so easy. I mean, there's really no point. In space, point. He came on, <laughs> came on for like two seconds. Another win in the bag. And a changing situation. I honestly game. thought whole City scoring. were gonna win it's that because they. They were doing amazing in the first half, but in the second half, it didn't really push us that much, which is crazy when I think about it. I, I thought there'd be more pushback from them. Yeah, it did very good. Let's say the pulse match interview again. See what they're saying. Just a couple of questions for you. Thank you for answering the questions. Yes, not on. Ooh, that is gonna be interesting. Can you get Sheffield United in our next game? Ooh, it will definitely come down to it. Going to Sheffield United. I'm gonna see who comes out on top because obviously we're currently tied for points. Can we give Sheffield United their first loss of the season? And that is the question for the next episode. I'm very excited for it, to be honest. I'm looking forward to seeing what we can do. Hopefully we can win. I'm probably gonna put on our best plays for it as well. It depends on how the players are in terms of fitness. But yeah, I'm going to do that in the next episode. This episode was very entertaining. We got two wins very comfortably. Although Watford definitely gave us a fight. Which I'm grateful for. We need that in this series. But yeah, I want to go against Sheffield United in the next episode. If you do like this video, make sure to like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell. It basically tells you each time I upload a video. But, until next time guys. Adios.